Throughout history, humans have embarked on audacious projects to reshape the world. From building massive airports in remote areas to constructing entire artificial cities in the middle of the ocean, these feats of engineering were meant to symbolize innovation and progress. Yet, not all grand visions succeed. What went wrong? And why did these mega projects crumble? Stick around till the end to discover the shocking truths behind these once promising ventures. Today, we'll explore 10 of the world's most useless mega projects, diving into their history, their failures, and the lessons they leave behind. This is I Am Civil Engineer, and we're about to uncover the stories of billion dollar disasters and abandoned dreams. Number 10, Mirabel Airport. In the 1970s, Montreal was Canada's gateway to the world. As air travel soared, the government envisioned a massive new airport to meet future demand. Mirabel Airport opened in 1975 with space to handle 50 million passengers annually, equivalent to Canada's entire population at the time. But there was one glaring issue. It was located over 50 kilometers from downtown Montreal with no direct rail connection. The promised high-speed train project was canceled due to budget overruns, leaving passengers reliant on slow, unreliable shuttle buses. Airlines and travelers quickly abandoned Mirabel for Toronto's Pearson Airport, which had better transport links. By 2004, all passenger flights were suspended. Today, Mirabel serves as a cargo hub and an amateur go-kart track. A project once meant to showcase Canada's global ambitions now sits as a stark reminder of the cost of poor planning. Number 9. Wonderland Eurasia Turkey had high hopes for Wonderland Eurasia, Europe's largest amusement park. Opened in 2019 near Ankara, it featured 17 roller coasters, giant fiberglass dinosaurs, and extravagant attractions. The $800 million project was expected to draw 5 million visitors a year. But the park's attractions turned out to be poorly built, and maintenance issues plagued its rides. Visitors left scathing reviews, and attendance plummeted. Within a year, Wonderland Eurasia closed its gates, leaving behind a deserted landscape of rusting dinosaurs and decaying rides. In 2022, locals pushed for the site to be turned into a public green space, signaling the end of Turkey's dream of hosting a world-class amusement park. What remains is a dystopian reminder of wasted potential. Number 8. Eco-Atlantic Nigeria's Eco-Atlantic was an ambitious response to a growing crisis. Over decades, the Atlantic Ocean had eroded Nigeria's coastline, swallowing entire communities. In 2003, the government launched a bold plan. Reclaim land from the ocean and build a luxury city on an artificial peninsula. Protected by the Great Wall of Lagos, a massive seawall designed to withstand storms, Eco-Atlantic was meant to house 250,000 residents and become a hub of modern living. But nearly two decades later, the project remains largely incomplete. Only a few residential towers dot the sandy peninsula, surrounded by empty roads and half-built structures. Environmentalists have also criticized the project for disrupting local ecosystems. In 2012, floods linked to the altered currents caused devastating damage raising questions about the long-term viability of the plan. Eco-Atlantic stands as a half-finished dream, its future uncertain. Number 7. Millennium Dome London's Millennium Dome was built to celebrate the year 2000 with a year-long exhibition showcasing British culture, science, and innovation. The enormous structure, located on the Greenwich Peninsula, cost over 800 million pounds to build. But after the celebrations ended, the government had no clear plan for its future. Maintenance costs soared to one million pounds a month, and public criticism mounted over wasted taxpayer money. For years, the dome sat empty, a symbol of mismanagement. In 2007, it was reborn as the O2 Arena, a world-class entertainment venue with concerts, restaurants, and sports events. While the dome's failure was eventually redeemed, it remains a lesson in the importance of planning for long-term success. Number 6. Bataan Nuclear Power Plant The Bataan Nuclear Power Plant in the Philippines was meant to revolutionize the country's energy sector. Construction began in 1976, but safety concerns soon emerged. The plant was built near fault lines and a volcano, 
raising fears of earthquakes and eruptions. By the time construction finished in 1984, costs had ballooned to $2 billion. Then the Chernobyl disaster struck, highlighting the dangers of nuclear power. Facing public opposition, the government decided never to activate the plant. For decades, Bataan sat abandoned, costing millions in maintenance while the Philippines struggled with energy shortages. It remains a stark symbol of wasted resources and the consequences of poor foresight. Number 5. New South China Mall Dubbed the largest shopping mall on Earth, the New South China Mall in Dongguan opened in 2005 with space for over 2,000 stores. But the city's relatively low-income population meant there was little demand for high-end retail, and 99% of the mall sat vacant for years. Rebranded in 2019 as a destination for affordable markets and food stalls, the mall has since gained popularity. However, its transformation came too late to justify its billion-dollar price tag. Number 4. The World Islands Dubai's World Islands were designed to resemble a miniature map of Earth, with each artificial island representing a country or landmark. Built at a cost of billions, these islands were sold to developers with promises of luxury resorts and private mansions. Yet, poor infrastructure and high costs have left most islands deserted. Reports of the islands sinking back into the sea have only added to their woes. While a few projects, like a beach club and shopping center, exist, the majority remain barren sandpiles, a stark contrast to Dubai's usual success stories. Number 3. Ryugyong Hotel North Korea's 105-story Ryugyong Hotel began construction in 1987. Meant to showcase the nation's strength, the hotel has instead become a symbol of its struggles. Construction stalled for decades due to financial issues, and although the exterior was completed, the interior remains unfinished. Nicknamed the Hotel of Doom, it looms over Pyongyang as a monument to failed ambition. Number 2. Ciudad Real Airport Spain's Ciudad Real Airport was designed to alleviate traffic at Madrid's Barajas Airport. Opened in 2008, it cost over $1 billion but failed to attract airlines. Within four years, it was closed, leaving an empty terminal and a vast runway unused. Number 1. Palm Jebel Ali Dubai's Palm Jebel Ali was announced in 2002 as the second palm-shaped island. While the land reclamation was completed, the global financial crisis halted development. Today, the island remains empty, with no infrastructure or homes built. It's a stark reminder that even Dubai's ambitious projects can falter. These 10 mega-projects reveal the fine line between ambition and folly. Each was born from grand visions but faltered due to poor planning, mismanagement, or external challenges. While some, like the Millennium Dome and New South China Mall, found redemption, others remain haunting reminders of wasted potential. As we look to the future, these stories offer valuable lessons. Ambition must be tempered with realism, and every dream requires careful planning to become a reality. Which of these projects surprised you the most? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more stories of incredible engineering, both triumphs and failures.